right here on this floor. <laughs> we could have some violent sex on this floor. <laughs> we could. Um, so yeah, we're at Keystone here today. Yep. And we just hit the back side of the mountain, just shredded some complete sick gnar out there. It's actually pretty icy, so had me worried a couple times, not gonna lie. But um, yeah, what were your thoughts of the back half? There's been a couple times where I was really tempted to just kind of wipe out for fun. Um, other than that, it was a pretty good day. Uh, pretty icy. You know, you can't say that the snow is great here because it's, it's really not. not. It's not. It's not great. Um, as you can see, these people are, I don't know what they're doing. Looks like they're skiing and snowboarding. Yeah, but snowboarders again, everyone knows that, so. Snowboarders suck because they ruin the snow and that's why all the snow here at Keystone sucks because a lot of snowboarders come here. Anywhere there are snowboarders, you're gonna have a shitty day. That's a fact. Oh, I heard one of you guys snowboard. Who's that? Snowboarders suck. Yeah, yeah well, you're a fucker. So <laughs> Terrible. I think snowboarders are the coolest people on the planet. Yeah. And my mom told me not to care what other people think of me, so. <laughs> yeah, he still lives with his mom, fun fact. So, <laughs> uh, that's a snowboarder for you. I was raised on a farm! So, keep updated. Uh, we're going to be checking back with you guys every day. Tomorrow, we're actually going to head to downtown Leadville. We're going to take some pictures. We're going to get some coffee, uh, take some pictures. Yeah, I wouldn't call it a date, but it's probably a date. It's a date. Right here in Leadville. Walking down the main street here, We've got a nice mural right behind us. A lot of locals are looking at us like, what the fuck are these kids doing? Like this guy, he's like, what are, what are we doing? <laughs> uh, literally walking down the street with a selfie stick, by the way, like, total, total tourist. I've, I've never seen the Rocky Mountains before, so it's pretty cool. It's a busy day here, it's a Wednesday. Kind of surprising all the traffic out here. Lots of traffic. Lots of people, you know, this town used to be one of the busiest towns, most populated towns west of the Mississippi at one point in the United States history. So that's As pretty cool. As you can cool. tell by the booming industry going on behind yeah. us. Uh, a lot of cool shops, a lot of cool paintings and stuff. This door is pretty cool. Might get a few pictures of that. We've been uh, taking some good pictures. You'll see those on our Instagram later, follow us. Yeah, follow us on Instagram, James underscore A underscore Lang. We got a come and go over here, that's pretty cool. What's up, YouTube? Uh, me and James went off-roading. Got his truck stuck in this pretty deep snow. So, fire it up, James. Let's see how this does. Hey, what's up, guys? So, update. The truck's stuck. <laughs> Learned the native tricks. or kicking sticks underneath the tires, and that helps it grip. So, that's what we're doing. Um, Sorry, things, Dad. Things are looking pretty down right now. <laughs> front tires are screwed. Back tires, if we can just get the front tires for traction, they'll be able to come out. It's quite beautiful up here. We might have to hunt some food. Yeah, good thing we brought our guns. We're gonna go deer hunting if this doesn't work out. Um, yep, yeah, stick that under there. Give me a flat tire if you can, please. This is kind of what's going on. It was fun up until this point. Um, we'll, we'll keep you updated. So, we couldn't get the truck out of the snow after like two hours of trying to get it out. So, Mr. Forest Ranger here is going to give us a ride back up to the cabin. Yeah, uh, and, um, we're just going to come back here tomorrow with Wesley's friends and their Jeep and pull us out because I wasn't trying to pay $750 for a towing <laughs> truck to come up here. And... It's been a really fun day, really adventurous. Yeah, really good. We've Something we can look back and laugh on, but right now it's a pretty shit day. Um, yeah, so we'll keep you guys updated. Yeah, it's Probably getting a lot more walking in our future. Yeah, so. a lot more walking, and it's getting dark out. These were the last two people we probably see all day, and if we didn't see them, <laughs> we would be kind of stranded on top of a little mountain. So, I, I hope. Um, Hope we get it out tomorrow, and I'm sure we'll do another funny vlog at that time. 
So we had Mr. Park Ranger take us all the way back to the bottom of the Beaver Lake State's like trail to get up to the cabin. So now we're gonna walk the four miles up to, <laughs> up to the cabin from the bottom. So it's gonna be a great time. Yeah, the car is currently behind us. It's, it's right halfway up there. Mount Elbert. Um, it's supposed to be about half inch of snow tonight. And then tomorrow morning, we're gonna take the Jeep. We're gonna go up there, shovel it out. Bring it back. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be fun. It's then, gonna be exciting. We're gonna have to go skiing as well. We need to do that. We made it there! Hey! We made it we're back! Not home! Dead. We're not dead! Do we have a car? No, <laughs> we're not dead! Great dinner. James made some ramen. I made some chicken. <laughs> made some ramen. <laughs> it was great. Uh, pretty happy with the way things turned out. Could have been a lot worse. Yeah, um, I'm thrilled with the way things turned out. I'm so happy. It's all right. Whenever my friends get up here, they're going to be coming in pretty late tonight. Uh, we will talk to them. Go, we, fi yeah, go we'll fix everything tomorrow. And we'll interview them. We're on a uh, rescue mission. For for what? Um, <laughs> for your guys' truck. <laughs> I'm the guy with the Jeep. My name's Jeez, Evan. Evan. That's Evan? Uh, he has the Jeep? Oh, I have the Jeep. Wow. Um, I'm Adam. I have a shotgun in the Jeep. Do you do, do you do anything else in shotgun? Do you, do you uh, provide any services? Kind of on ox duty, or <laughs> roadhead duty if we get really bored. Um, sometimes I just you know reach over. <laughs> if you had a, if you had to farm one one resource, what would it be? If I had to farm one resource, yeah, people. <laughs> the first time you guys had sex, he was actually with Evan. <laughs> It was a warm he was, on, he was on the drive up here. On the morrow <laughs> of December 21st, 2014. <laughs> oh, the first time we had sex. Oh, shit. <laughs> it was three hours ago. Uh -huh. Um, we were fully clothed. It began with dry humping. <laughs> Four hours straight of denim on denim. <laughs> This is the friends with the Jeep right there. He's back there. Uh, uh, we're walking up to the truck right now. Gonna see if we can get it unstuck. Ooh, I'm pretty pretty optimistic. We've got a lot of manpower here. Mm. Uh, Broad yeah. shoulders. Yes, exactly. And uh, abs. Abs. so and we'll keep shovel. you we'll keep you guys updated. What's up, YouTube? I'm We're taking over the GoPro for the next probably four to six minutes. Oh, it is. Uh, oh, it because is. Uh, this is Adam. our boys are our boys are here digging, and uh, we just yeah, we just. Encourage them in. We just gave them a ride. So, uh, yeah, we are clearly a big help and we're getting ready to push this bitch out. We did it! <laughs> we got the car! Woo! Look at these. <laughs> Woo! Do I like to ski? Yeah. Do I like to hit bad jumps? Yeah. <laughs> gonna cut to a video of me just hitting like the littlest pussy jumps and then like hey, wrecking. <laughs> hey, what's up YouTube? Just got the boys in the gondola here. Uh, it took a little while to get Adam's still fixing his pants. I right, interrupted you but I'm just gonna <laughs> say I've just gone kind of full Jerry today. <laughs> We've accepted it mm -hmm. and uh yeah. it's just gonna just only gonna go up from here. <laughs> You want to explain yourself? Well, so I've got these nice cream colored pants and they're actually very warm and pretty practical. And then I'll just stand up for you to see the full effect. Uh, it's kind of tight in the garage. Oh my god. <laughs> and uh, really tight up here because I have the jacket actually tucked in underneath the bitch. Because so style. Pushes up the breast. Yeah. So yeah. I, I, I am also wearing push up bra. I mean, it's a trainer, obviously. So. What size are you, Wilson? I'm a double A. Wow. <laughs> double A. <laughs> That's huge. Um. So this is my costume. I decided I was the gay pride marshmallow man. <laughs> so uh, that's <laughs> this is what we're doing. Today. <laughs> I'm the 1980s ski dad. So basically, dope alert. <laughs> I, I just kind of shred the slopes and then look for the hotties and say, hey, wanna go eat some fondue at my place after this? <laughs> Hey, what's up, guys? <laughs> um, so we're here at the Beta House, right there, Beta. Yeah. Um, so we were originally gonna stay at the cabin another night, but then Wesley's dad said that there might be a lot of snow tonight and the highway could shut down. So we're just gonna give a recap of our day today. So it started out like any other normal morning. We got up, 
and we had some breakfast and then we drove to the ski resort and we were going to do a little skiing. We also stopped in at Subway because we were out of lunch meat and bread. So we had to get lunch and so we got footlongs and they were delicious. I think we did a total of four <laughs> So we did a total of like four runs. It was pretty lame. We hit on some cute girls because um, Adam can do a really good New Zealand accent. Hello? What did, I, what did I say? What's your name? My name's Adam. I'm from Auckland, New Zealand. And uh, I'm yes. just really happy to be here in the mountains in Colorado. <laughs> Alright, and what are you um, cooking for us uh, today? today we, let's see. Today I've already made grilled cheese. I made some ramen noodles. And today I'm going to show you my special dessert drink. It's called hot chocolate, but with vodka. So, hot, vo hot vodka lit. <laughs> So what you do, you take the hot chocolate, it's that already made here, here, get a nice waft. Wow, that's impressive. Mm, very nice. Okay. And then you just pour a little bit of vodka in there, or what, it depends on how much you want. And we were like, yeah, let's start packing up to get ready to go to Denver. And we packed up. James is sitting in the truck, and I get in, and he's like, you're not going to believe this. We have four miles left of gas before we run out. And town is like eight miles away. You might say like ten. <laughs> yeah. So we're like, okay, that's that's great. We drove and we hit zero miles to empty, and we were like, shoot, we better still have some gas because the gas station's not for like another two miles or so. I <laughs> uh, can we get gas, please? Dude, it says they're open. Why are they're, they're just open? Locked. <laughs> Look at these pumps. Look at this. We're gonna die out here. <laughs> Got to the first gas station. It was more expensive, so we just filled a gallon and then drove to the next cheaper gas station <laughs> and filled up the whole tank, which was $65, $65. And then drove to Denver. And we were like, all right, cool. We can just go spend the night in my fraternity house. Mm -hmm. And so that's where we are now. Uh, Adam and Evan are on their way to meet back up with us. Um, and then we're gonna go out tonight, have a good time. <laughs> Hey guys, driving into James' neighborhood currently. Well, made it all the way back. About to drive in there, but yeah, we made it back safe and sound. Filled gas a couple times, ran low on gas a couple times, you know, had to stop in a really sketchy location to try and get some gas. Yeah. James is pretty excited to get home. I'm pretty excited to get home. I think our siblings are more excited for us to get home, <laughs> yeah. honestly. Like, Both of our siblings have been texting us, so they're like, hey, we need you guys to come back. We're yeah, so probably won't hang out with them. Pretty good trip. Overall thoughts on the trip, Wes? I'd say pretty good.